We'll ask you more questions later, Bobby Bass. Even though you probably won't share any of that information, because it doesn't involve titties or dogs or plants. Well, what if it does involve titties or dogs or plants? What if it involves all three? What if there's a big-titted dog who likes plants? Or a big-titted flower that likes dogs? Or some kind of half-dog, half- Stop! Stop! I can only get so erect. (laughs) A flower with a dog's face? You've you've ruined my pants. (laughs) (laughs) This one... As a preacher. Alright, now you might think I don't like killing man of the cloth, but this is an exception. Oh. Reverend Hitchens. He's a zombie. He's always preaching about corruption, gambling, basically the things that put food on our table. We do not believe Reverend Hitchens is quite so pristine as he makes out. In fact, he's something of a wild man, wild ghoul, whatever. To be clear, I like I like sex, I like love making, I'm normal, you know, I like I like to fuck Three women at a time. That that's that's normative behavior. He oh, doesn't. He, he he's taking it to about five six levels higher. He's having these big orgies with zombies with dead skin and slime and everything. Oh. Disgusting. Oh, I wouldn't. You somebody tell me to put my dick in a ghoul. I'd say fuck you, motherfucker. You can you can eat my dick. <laughs> I, I just would not do that. Uh, absolutely fucking not. You get more than disease. Your dick come back rotting off. You be glowing in the dark. You jizz come out fucking green like a like goddamn toothpaste. I don't like that. <laughs> so here's what we're going to do. Take your gun. Take your nice little subsonic 22s. Go find the preacher man. Put him on right in his head. And you come on back. You get paid. All right, then. Let's get out of here. You see, are you going to keep wearing that construction hat for how, how much longer? You know, I don't know. I forgot I had it on. <laughs> we'll wear it for a little bit longer. Just in case some rocks fall on your head? Just in case, like, an I-beam lands on my head or something? I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon. Protect us, Lord, and keep us safe. Uh, what? What are we shooting at? Why is shooting happening? Speaking of someone who needs to get stabbed... Watch out. Oh, no! It's... Who the hell is this? I don't know! It's a hype junkie! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so these guys were on hype! They love killing. They love to kill. Here you go, Hope. Got a trophy for you. Lick my tube steak, you piece of shit. Whoa! Yeah, I thought we had eradicated the hype train, but apparently that's still a thing. Apparently the hype train is still very real. Looks like there might be a resurgence we might have to take care of later. A resurgence of hype. God, Hope, think of the consequences. Have you found it? I think so. I think this is it. The The first church of the eternal flame. That sounds like where we need to go. Brothers and sisters, I have brought you here today to celebrate our Lord and Savior, the Dark Lord Cthulhu. Let's look around. There might be some clues as to this person's character. Mm -hmm. Uh, An empty sunset sarsaparilla crate. A desk calendar with some notes on it that I can't read because I don't read chicken scratch. Now this place is clean and he does have calendars out so he's organized. So it sounds Seems like somewhat he's... organized. There's no bottles of alcohol behind the pulpit. And also, there is not a bucket to relieve himself in like Jim Jones. I'm not going to ask. Jim Jones did that. Ooh, what is... Oh. We did know about this, yes. Smooth skin. Thank you for complimenting me. Ah! <laughs> They're not happy with us. Well, that turned off. Hope, awesome. kill him immediately. Oh God, Hope, I'm sorry. Don't step in front of me like Don't that. Don't damage my handiwork. I can't help it. She got in the way. Looks like the orgy's over, buddy. I can come up with a better one-liner. Give me a second. All right, um, okay. Orgy over. No, that just makes me sound stupid. I um I uh. Looks like it's an orgy for zero today. That's not bad. That's not bad. I think we can do better. What, wicker. Something with wicker. I don't care about your sexual proclivities. Just shut up and die quietly. Maybe. Maybe. There's still people having sex somewhere. Is there? You can hear them. <laughs> maybe we could walk in and invade that orgy as well. <laughs> Is that going to be our new job? We just ruin orgies? <laughs> Zack and Mike, bounty hunters and professional orgy ruiner. I already <laughs> ruin orgies. <laughs> Alright, I know how we can get away with this murder. Okay. I have this single shotgun. We'll just... There we go. That's uh, that's one. Let's do this. You're framing him for the massacre. At his own orgy. Yep. He invited them all here so he could murder them all. Yes! After having sex with them. What a sick, disgusting pervert. And then, not being able to deal with the guilt... He shot himself in the mouth! 
We've done it. It's it's perfect. No one will ever suspect that we had anything to do with this. Let's go. Let's let Bobby Bass know that we just showed up and he's already dead. Yep. So good to see you. We took care of it. He's dead. But if anybody else asks, it was a murder-suicide. That we had no part in. We weren't even there for the orgy. We were too late. Oh, that's just terrific. Oh, that's great. I'm, I'm so happy that you were here to take care of this kind of nonsense for us. Nonsense is right. I, I don't know. I don't even want to think about what you had to see, what you had to endure in that nasty, nasty church. Lots of ghouls and I negligee. Did. You know what? You didn't worry about the details. You went in there. Now... We get our own gun store, and you get paid. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't like thinking about that. Yes, thinking about flowers is a lot more palate cleansing. Ah, yes, flowers. Are they mums? They're petunias. They're tums. They're petunias. The tums. Shall we get another quest? Sorry what? to interrupt your plant watering, but we would like to take on another contract. Yes, we would. I'm very pleased that you're back, because we have a big job for you. I think... It's one of the most important jobs we've ever given out. Don't build it up too much. This job is about Jackie Freehorn. If you don't know Jackie Freehorn, odds are about half the men you've met have whacked off to his movies at some point or another because he is a pornographer. Oh, Jackie Freehorn! The pretty good smutty movies, uh, sometimes the plot, uh, a little bad. What's a porno? Bad acting, bad voicing. It, it's so bad it hurts your heart <laughs> on. Are people just that lazy? Yeah. Do they think we won't notice? There's no excuse. Yeah. I guess as long as people are simple enough to buy that shit, they'll keep making it. This issue is not about the quality of his movies. Uh, it is about money, as is with most of our affairs. Mm -hmm. Mr. Judge Richter is now the premier protection man, and Mr. Freehorn refuses to recognize this and, uh... Does not pay the toll. Mm. We have put animal heads in his bed. All manner of nastiness that usually does the trick, but not so with Mr. Freehorn. I'm afraid he has to go. He carries a gun, thinks he's some kind of cowboy, so you just take this little subsonic 22, put that right in the back of his head, then get paid. He just keeps giving you silencer ammo, but you're not going to use the 22. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is a Big Lebowski reference? Yes, it is. V.I. Lenin! Vladimir Ilyinich Ulinov! This is Nom, dude. You're not wrong. You're just an asshole. Well, the money wasn't even in the bag. I gave my dirty undies. My frickin' whites. <laughs> this is what happens when you find a stranger out in the Alps! <laughs> this is what happens when you feed a stranger hey. scrambled eggs! What do you need? No, he's just a nightclub guard. No, he's a nightclub guard. I guess this is it. Hello, dude. Thanks for coming. Yep. <laughs> I'm Jackie Freeman. <laughs> Wait, you're not the new fluffer. You, you're armed. Richter sent you, didn't he? No! Well, I'm not going to be pushed around anymore. Fluffers, it's time for double penetration. Let's not, oh, God! Oh, let's not jump to anything. I don't like the sound of any of this. Ah, I can't believe it. No, we're killing porn stars! No, 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 no. Let no. him escape! No, there's no reason to assassinate the porn stars who are fleeing. All right. Well, we killed the fluffers, which is is it's fine. The nobody nobody cares about the fluffers. <laughs> A note on Jackie Freehorn. Yes, Mr. Freehorn has come to my understanding that your life may be in danger, and agents of Judge Richter may soon make a move against you. I behoove you to leave the Mojave Wasteland, albeit temporarily, until Richter and Associates are neutralized. I want to assure you that in time you'll be able to conduct your business free from the fear of extortion or abuse. Sincerely, Robertson. Hmm. Who's Robertson? I don't know. That's the first time I've seen that name. Oh, he just took a nap. He's really tired. <laughs> yeah. He's well, had a very busy day. He watched his producer and fellow fluffers get killed. I think it's really more that he's been climaxing for about six hours straight. And the, the note on the bottle says if it lasts more than four hours, you need to call a doctor. But Jackie was like, you don't need to call a doctor. Get back on that bed. Yeah, jeez. I can only imagine the rough life, the terribly rough life that male porn stars must have. You think it's going to be all glamorous, but no, they get worked to the bone. Ah, <laughs> uh, I wish I could point the shotgun in my own mouth. <laughs> There's less than 200 porn stars for all of Japan. Less than 200 male porn stars for all of Japan. How many female porn stars? Oh, what? Lots? <laughs> lots and lots and lots. This guy works all the time. Like, he gets up at four in the morning, and he goes and works, and then he's not done working until, like, midnight. 
holy crap, this dude bones all day. That's, like, all he's doing. And he's like, eh, I gotta, like, focus my chi before I go in there to, like, bone girls. And we make jokes about it, but it actually is a pretty rough life when you have to do it as a job. Yeah, in Japan, you can't really get any credit for it because a lot of the porn industry there is still, like, censored. They pretty much censor a lot of the stuff. And how much extra work do Japanese porn stars have to go through to blur their genitals while they're having sex? Oh, man, I can't even imagine. The mental focus you would have to have to blur your own genitals. Well, actually, I shouldn't say that because check it out. Mine are blurred right now. You can't even see them. Yours are invisible. That's yeah. easier. You're gonna take hope? Yeah, hope is mine. Uh, I guess you appreciate my craftsmanship. She gave her a dress with pockets, though. Well, she's got pockets on that blue jeans. They're probably those little tiny pockets they put on girls' pants that you can't actually fit anything in there. That's her old outfit. I've been keeping it all this wow! time. Wow! I didn't even realize that was her old outfit. Well, I guess she has a back... Does she normally have a backpack? She normally has a backpack on, but I felt it. It was just too much. Well, she does have robot legs now, so I guess she can support more weight. Well, she needs to carry all these chainsaws. Yeah, all, all the 15 chainsaws she has. In case one of them breaks, you never know. Jackie Freehorn is dead. Oh, that's just fantastic. Fantastic. I knew you was going to take care of that. You went, you took care of that crazy cowboy director. Man wouldn't listen to reason. Thought because he looked at cocks and pussies all day, he was invincible. It just don't work like that, you it know? It doesn't, really. You deserved yourself a nice little break here. You take your break. So you just do whatever it is that you do, and you come on back when you want to make some more money. You take care now. <laughs> is this how you relax, Hope? <laughs> this is how you relax? By doing housework? <laughs> uh, That's not what relaxing is. Relaxing isn't doing how... I don't know. Who am I to judge? You maybe, know what? maybe she finds doing housework relaxing. You can't really judge. I used to rake to relax, so this is not all that different. <laughs> you hear what the chatty cat said to the tongue? I just don't get you. <laughs> She's going to share that Hope, joke with a, everyone. That's a dry hole. He ain't gonna say it. <laughs> oh my god, she's teaching him! Competitive sweeping, go! Go, 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 go! I got money on hope. I got 12 bucks on hope. Oh, who can clean up that lamp first? <laughs> lamp? It's a fan, Mike. Oh, hope won. Hope totally won. Uh, she, right. had more st <laughs> she had more stamina than this guy. Life's all about breaks. You gotta know when to make them and when to take them. Boy, this is a real grisly scene, Dick. What do you make of it? Oh, I've seen this a million times. Guy invites a bunch of ladies over for an orgy, but it's really a trap so he can kill them all. You can tell by the facial lacerations that each one was killed by a shotgun blast to the face. And then finally, the perpetrator, unable to live with the guilt, turned the shotgun on himself and pulled the trigger. Far too many orgies end like this in my experience. That is some expert detective work you've got there, Flatfoot. Why do a couple of them look like they've been hit with a chainsaw? I am going to give uh, Hope 20 gauge shotgun and some ammo, though. You let me know if you need any extra clothes. Beds around here are so cold you'll shake like a hound dog on Elvis night. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really funny joke. You're the best, Hope. Never stop.